Hello, and welcome to the fourth in our series of Passwords Fast instructional videos. By the end of this video, you will know how to access the Options menu and configure the options for your Passwords Fast device, as well as how to completely reset the device to the factory default. Now, let's get started. First, turn on your Passwords Fast and enter your master password to get into the device. Notice that the characters you type appear as asterisks, which is a security feature. When you have finished entering your password, press Enter. At the password entry screen, press the function key, then press the escape key, whose blue text says OPT, short for options. Make sure to press the keys one at a time. This brings up the Device Options screen, which has several device options that we can set. Press the up and down arrows to scroll through the different options. Notice that one option at a time has white text on a black background, meaning that it is currently selected. The first option is Screen Level. This sets how light or dark the text appears on the screen. Its default value is 10, with the lightest value being 1 and the darkest being 20. With this option selected, press the left arrow key to decrease this value, making the text lighter. Press the right arrow key to increase the value, making the text darker. Press the down arrow to move on to the second option. The second option is the timeout. This sets how long it takes the password's fast device to automatically shut itself off when idle. This automatic shutoff feature saves battery life, turning your password's fast off if you forget to. The default setting is 60 seconds. With this option selected, press the left arrow key to decrease the amount of time it takes to automatically turn off by 15 seconds each press. You can turn this automatic shutdown off by pressing the left arrow key until it says off. This setting is not recommended. Press the right arrow to increase the amount of time it takes before automatic shutdown, up to a maximum of 240 seconds or four minutes. The third option is Number of Login Tries. This sets the number of times you can incorrectly enter the master password to get into your passwords fast without an error message. The default setting is 5. If I put in the wrong master password five times in a row, it will display too many failed logins, turning device off for 15 seconds then automatically turns the device off. You can then turn your passwords fast back on and try again. Press the left arrow key to decrease the number of tries before the login failure screen. Press the right arrow key to increase it. The minimum number of tries is one. You can also turn it off, but that is not recommended. Maximum is 10. Pressing the Enter key with any of these three options selected saves the current options. Pressing the Enter key again takes you back to the Password Entries screen. Let's go back into the Options screen by pressing the Function key, then pressing the Escape key. Let's scroll down to the fourth option, Change Password. Pressing Enter on this option brings us to the Change Password screen, which allows us to change the Passwords Fast Master Password. On the Change Password screen, it asks you to enter the current Master Password. Type in the Master Password, then press the Enter key. Next, it asks for a new password, 
which is the new master password you want the device to have. Type in the new master password and press the Enter key. Now, it will ask to confirm password. Re-enter the new master password and press the Enter key. Lastly, we see a message asking us to press the Enter key to initiate changing the password, or press the Escape key to cancel the process. Press the Enter key to start the process. Your password's fast, will turn itself off when finished. If you have a lot of passwords, this process may take a few minutes. Turn back on the device and now enter your new master password. The last option is Reset Device which allows us to reset the passwords fast back to factory default, wiping out all password entries and clearing out the master password. On the Reset Device screen, you will see the message, Clear all entries and device password. Enter to continue or escape to go back. Press Enter. You will then be asked to confirm reset by pressing Enter or Escape to cancel. Press the Enter key to completely wipe the device. You will now see the message on the screen, device will turn off once memory is erased. The passwords fast will then turn off. When we turn it back on, notice that it brings up the Create Password screen as if the Passwords Fast unit was brand new. If you need to reset your device back to factory default and forget your master password, which would allow you to get to the Options menu, there is another way to do this. Turn on your Passwords Fast. At the Enter Passwords screen, press Function, then press the Option key. This will then give you the reset option prompts to reset the device. Thank you for watching this video on how to change device options on your passwords fast.